Okay, folks, let's see what we can do with this one. You can hear the birds twittering out there. They don't know about the lockdown that we're having here in Sydney, Australia, the greater Sydney area. Let's see how we go. Okay, let's see what we can do with this piece. Okay, it is a shopping bag. Indeed, it's not a clothing item like I normally would demo with, but we'll just show you the design. But basically, something made of cloth I thought I'd use because I don't have many uh, clothing items because we're under a lockdown, as you probably know in the news. And Sydney is right centre stage of it. And we're trying to beat the uh, Delta strain of coronavirus, which we are really abysmally failing at doing. And this disease is just coming loose more and more every, almost every day. Occasionally it slows down and then it ramps up again. So I don't have access to secondhand clothing shops. The op shops are closed, so I'm using what I can and I'm trying to get stuff off the side of the road in order to supply my need for articles to use. Now that looks interesting. I didn't want that bit at the top. It may not be a bad thing. I'm going to make it into a movement piece, I do think. I do th I think maybe we're just going to take it off. But basically I'm really disappointed with how things have played out over Sydney, uh, the Delta variant of coronavirus is extreme, extremely contagious and doesn't respond very well to tippy toes. You know, tippy toes being the, um, the suppression games that we've been playing uh, to avoid this kind of shit happening. And now it just seems the well, Delta variant is much more harder to control. And we do need more people getting vaccinated in order to avoid further lockdown. And people are balking at it because they're scared that they're going to die off the, off the uh, AstraZeneca vaccine, which really it's a rare occurrence compared with the death toll of people who catch COVID, which is what we really should be afraid of, not the fucking... Vaccine, if everyone could just pull their fingers out and get vaccinated, well, we could finish this lockdown in a, in a, hopefully, yeah, may take a while because people will have to get a second dose, I think, to get the full immunity. But they're trying to get at least one dose into people's arms because that's still better than absolutely nothing. I just get so exasperated with the masses, you know, I just get so really annoyed that they're worrying about it. Now that looks really quite nice. I do think we can use this. So maybe that'll be the centre of the job. No, I don't want that. Actually, I do think we might have to enlarge it bigger. Okay, I'm just going to take that one away. I'm going to use this one. So we're going to use maybe enlarge vertically and a little bit on the horizontal. But really, I'm just getting so so annoyed 
with how things are happening and people are just so afraid of of the AstraZeneca dose. You know, I know that, you know, there have been blood clots and people have actually died. Yes, I understand. But what I can't understand is that the likelihood of that happening is a lot less than the actual COVID, catching the COVID. And you don't want to be suffering from the COVID symptoms, like having to be put on a ventilator or having to having to gasp for every breath and having the potential for permanent damage, you know, like, and you have, you exhibit uh, symptoms long after the disease has been and destroyed you. And yet people just don't seem to realise, you know, what's worse, you know, and they don't get it. And I, I just don't want to see any more of this fucking lockdown just because people are so stupid and scared. People are just, I really don't understand why it has to be like that. Because people love their social life. People love to shop. People love recreation and sport. You're losing it, folks. You're gonna lose it all for longer if you don't get vaxxed. You know, if you don't just take take a chance, uh, 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 you know, this virus is more, you can't stop it with playing tippy toes. It's not like the last, like last year, pre-Delta. Delta is a lot more vicious than that. She plays, she even kills children. And yet people would rather live side by side doing these stupid dumbass, they're not dumbass rituals, but they... They're becoming like that because Delta is, is making them useless. You know, like social distancing, wearing masks, QR codes, hand sanitation. You know, all that sort of stuff isn't, isn't working on its own anymore. It's not going to work. We can't just live like this. And people are losing their jobs and their livelihoods. The whole economy could collapse. We may all be poor. You know, we may be homeless. Only the few people could afford. You just don't know the risks that we're taking by being scared. You know, don't play it safe. Sometimes playing it safe is a lot more dangerous than, than taking a calculated risk. And this is a, a, a calculated risk that'll go to, that'll favor us rather than be a, prob, a major problem, you know? We need more people to take AstraZeneca. It's a good... It's been t hailed as a, a, a really good vaccine. Everything has risks, folks, you know. Just don't be scared. Take Astra. It's our only hope.